All right. Welcome to a game I've been wanting to try out ever since I heard about it. This is, of course, the new Sonic game, Sonic Mania. So, if you don't know about it, uh, what happened was Sega actually decided to license out the rights to Sonic to a third-party developer. Oops. Didn't want to do that. There we go. Okay, that's fine. I had to adjust it there, because uh, it starts out... Yeah, a window is extremely small when I start out there. Now, yeah, they licensed this, the game out to a third-party developer. One could surmise that was due to the string of horrible Sonic games that have come out, well, probably ever since the, uh, the end of the 90s. Now, I grew up with, with uh, early Sonic games as a, as a kid. Uh, in the early 90s, we had a Sega Genesis. I can't remember which year we bought it, but uh, I remember playing the game at a, uh, around 94. Um, and Sonic, okay, look, we had a Sega Genesis, and we had a, a Nintendo, the original Nintendo, okay? Um, look, Mar the Mario Brothers was fun, okay? It's a fun game, it's a good game. And the, the ones on the Super Nintendo, I, I played those at friends' houses, because we had the original, we didn't have... A Super Nintendo. Um, Sonic on the Sega Genesis or you know Mega Drive. I don't know. When I was young, it, it had something. You know, it had something that that uh, that Mario didn't have. Maybe it was the style. You know, the the, the graphics, the style of the graphics or something. I don't know. I, I always preferred it, and it was, you know, it was pretty unique for a for a, for a platformer game. You don't die normally, like in, in like most all platformer games. Of course, you collect the rings, and you only die, you only lose a life if you lose all of your rings and you get hit. So that was pretty, you know, unique, you know, compared to other, you know, platformer games. And, um, look, I don't know if I'm going to do a full playthrough of this game or not. So, I'm just going to let you know that right now, okay? Don't know. <laughs> it might get bullshitty like, like all platformer games do. I might, I might rage quit. So, yeah, I just wanted to check it out, you know, because it brings back memories. You know, I played through the first level of the game and I like what I see so far. Uh, looks really, really, well, it is fun. Um, and it's good that Sega finally decided, you know, hey, look, we've been really fucking up. You know, we need, we need to change shit here because there's a lot of people asking for, you know, a classic Sonic game. And as far as I know, this game has been extremely well received. And rightly so. This is, this is Sonic. Sonic isn't the shit that we've been seeing coming out over the past few years, well, past few years, over the past, well, over the past 15 years or so, I would say, 15, 17 years, you know, long fucking time, almost 20 years of, of shit Sonic games, you know, um, but yeah, you know, I don't know, you know, Japanese developers, they are, they're notoriously hard-headed in letting Westerners uh, do any kind of work on their games, you know? And, and, and look, I'm not just saying that it, it, it's something you can, you can fucking look up, okay? I've, I've read about it several times about people who, you know, had you know, went over there, you know, back in the day as well, you know, 
And, you know, the Japanese, you know, they would just say, uh, you know, what does this Westerner know about, about programming? You know what I mean? What does he fucking know? What does he know about writing code? You know what I mean? Uh, not only that, but, uh, you know. No, no, even though Sega started out as an American company, you know what I mean? And that's the truth. Sega, Sega did start out. In the United States first, it was founded by by three uh, American guys uh, in Hawaii, I believe. They were making uh, little. It was during the the first the, the Second World War, actually. They they were making like slot machines and, and just little mechanical, basic mechanical arcade games. You know what I mean? For the um, for the soldiers on on the military bases. You know that's what they were doing. That's how Sega got its start. You can go, you can go read about it if you like, if you don't believe me. But that's how it got its, uh, its start. Okay, it didn't start out in Japan. Uh, anyway, so let's get into Mania mode and just wow, look at all these save slots. Holy shit! And you can choose who you want to play as. You can play as, of course, uh, Sonic and Tails. Play as Sonic alone, Tails alone. Or you can play as Knuckles. We're gonna play as Sonic and Tails. Because I have lots of memories playing Sonic 2 as a child. Eggman! That was another reference I just did there. Well, not even, not really a reference. There's a, there's a fusion of references. Oh, I'll stop. So yeah, as you can see here, they, they redid the, the first level of the... ...of the first game. That classic music. You know, this music, when I was a child... It used to get me hyped to play this game. You know what I mean? And I, I used to love this level. You know, it was so... I don't know, so peaceful looking, you know? I, I used to lo always love the graphics of this level. In the, uh, the first game. Oh. I lost a lot of coins there. Oh, shit. Oh, God, where am I? Got a one up there. That's pretty good to get. Pretty cool power up, I always like this one. Oh no! Shit. I'm losing all the coins. I already missed the Chaos Emerald, but oh well. Okay, so the trick to, to, to the bosses and, well, a lot of the bosses in, in these, these 2D Sonic games is to stay in the corner. Uh, sometimes. Sometimes it, it, sometimes that doesn't work and sometimes that's not the case. Uh, but it usually is, is on the first boss. It's, the pattern's usually very simple. Rightfully so. Just the first, just the first boss, you know. Nope, oh, shouldn't have stood there. Alright. Okay, 
try to hit this as many times to get as many points as we can. As we, oh, and we can get another uh, one up by doing that. You can do that an infinite a number of times as long as you keep doing it. So, that's cool. Alright, now this is different. Got a little remix version of the music here. Looks cool. I like it, man. Try to get many, as many coins as I can here. Yeah, I missed that first Chaos Emerald. That's unfortunate. But uh, I can't remember where everything is on these levels, you know what I mean? Alright, this is a classic uh, obstacle here. Thank you, Tails. Already got another, another one up. That's cool. Ah, shit. Da -na 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 -na. Shit. And look, I don't want you guys to get it twisted. Um, I'm not a Sega fanboy. Okay. I just grew up with a Sega. Okay. And I enjoyed it. And, you know, I think, yeah, the, definitely the, the. The Sega Genesis the Smash Mega Drive had disadvantages over the Super Nintendo, but, you know, the Super Nintendo came out later as well, you know. Okay, so it looks like we just have to run away. Oh, can we kick those? No, okay. I, th I thought we could have... Maybe hit those or something. Okay, I might die here. Hmm. Maybe there's something I'm not doing here. I'm starting to think there is. Okay, you got it. Oh, shit. Okay, there we go. Easy enough. And of course, we freed the animals.
Because for some reason, Dr. Eggman or Robotnik, whatever you want to call him, thought it was a good idea turning animals into robots. All right, another classic area. This is one of them, one of them levels where you can really take advantage of uh, Sonic's speed here. Oh shit. No, 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 no. Let's not fall in there. I don't think that's good. I think it's good to fall in there. Oh god, we have to go in there. It's nasty purple water. You fucking bastard. There you go. Get out of here. No one of your shit. None of it. Oh, I remember. I remember these. These are fun. Not really, but you know. Oh. Should've... Should've looked at that better. What the fuck? Oh, that's nasty. I do not like that. <laughs> that's bullshitty. Oh god. Mm. Ah. There we go. Oh, I hate that, man. I hate being underwater in Sonic games, man. I fucking hate it. Ah! Okay. Uh oh, that was weird. I don't know what happened there. Okay. What we got going on here? Okay, can't touch it. Can't touch it when, when, when there's water on it. Simple enough, right?
and I just touched it when there was water on it. Smart of me, right? I should have just moved, but nah. Would have liked to hit it a bit more, but whatever. There we go. Got it. So yeah, I'm not going to be getting any bonuses this uh, this run through here. I can tell you that. I, I've literally not practiced any of these. I've not practiced any of the levels. You know what I mean? So it's just like I'm just I'm just winging it right now. So that's all you're going to get out of me. You know what I mean? This is definitely going to be a game I'm going to keep on my computer. You know what I mean? one of them kind of games when you don't know what to play you know play some Sonic see how long I can keep this going <laughs> jeez Fucking hell. This is the longest I've ever done this in any Sonic, any Sonic game. Just so you know. Canal. It's just an endurance test now. Just leave it alone. I'll just leave it be. I'll do one more level, I guess. Right. I'll do the next level and then, then probably, yeah, let's do this here and probably end the uh, video. This might be a one-off, a one-off kind of thing, you know what I mean? Check that out, that's weird. Fucking science experiments. <laughs> that's neat, I like that. Yeah, I like that, man. That's cool. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. What does this do? Let's go. Can we go up, please? Or not. Whatever. Okay, we gotta choose the directions. Okay. I was like, what <laughs> the fuck's going on? Oh, okay, the blue, don't touch the blue. Blue is bad.
All right, let's do this again. Oh, okay. You know, all the Sonic, like, Super Sonic fans are like, you know, You're not getting the Chaos Emeralds! It's like, fuck off. like Kirby's uh Kirby's Avalanche. Surprised Nintendo didn't say anything about this. Just beat him, and that's it. So I will say this was very unexpected. Very, very unexpected. Dude. I was totally expecting it. <laughs> it was pretty good. That was pretty good. Very, very unexpected right there. Very, very unexpected. Studiopolis? Okay, this is new, I think. It's very, very 90, 90s music here. Okay, so I'm going to end the video here, and, you know, maybe, maybe I'll come back. Maybe I'll do another video of it. The reason I did a video of this today is, well, number one, because I, I've, I've been itching to play this game ever since it came out, and I don't know what series, I don't know what I want to do exactly next for a series. I don't know. You know, I'm, I'm very indecisive. I have a few games in mind, you know, but it's just like, I don't know if I'm ex exactly in the mood to play them. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Like I said, I'll uh, end it here. And, you know, I'll see you guys next time.